There's an old adage in football, a day off can be really valuable, and uh, two days off can be life-changing. The Dallas Cowboys are hoping that's the case for Tony Romo. The Cowboys quarterback once again not participating in tonight's practice. Romo did work out in this morning's walkthrough, but again, it's a walkthrough. Nothing competitive, a lot of standing around, and a lot of situation drills. Jason Garrett started camp seven days ago by saying Romo was a full go. Now he's looking toward the future. It's a 16-game season that begins in September, and uh, it's the same approach we take here. Uh, let's keep going forward. Let's keep taking incremental steps, gradual steps to get you ready for that. On defense, the Cowboys will be without linebacker Sean Lee this season as he recovers from his second ACL tear. Lee has been with the team since the start of camp, but he talked for the first time today about making the most of a bad situation. You know, I learned from the first knee that the more you buy into the negativity, the slower you rehab. So I'm trying to stay positive. That's part of why I'm here. It's fun being around the team. It's fun being around the guys. And I think uh, they're helping me a lot more than I'm helping them. Now, the biggest news from day seven came during pass protection drills. The Cowboys' second round pick, Demarcus Lawrence, went down with what's being called an ankle sprain. With training camp, it's a grind. You know, people are going to have like bumps and bruises, but that's just part of camp. So, you know, anytime you see something, somebody go down, uh, you just hope that. It's just not as bad as it looks. Now, team owner Jerry Jones said after practice that Demarcus Lawrence will, in fact, have x-rays after practice to get a better look. But either way, things stepping in the wrong direction for the highly drafted prospect. In Oxnard, California, Marshall Hughes, CBS 7 Sports.